the surprising way Hertz is affecting you and the planet. By Lady Janice, the amazing woman. Have you ever thought about how Hertz is changing our lives and the planet? Electromagnetic frequencies are everywhere, affecting us in many ways. They impact the air we breathe and the tech we use. These frequencies are often unseen but play a big role in our lives and the environment. The effects of electromagnetic pollution are becoming clear. It's key to understand and manage our electromagnetic surroundings for our health and the planet's. Key takeaway. Electromagnetic frequencies are all around us, affecting our daily lives. Hertz affecting Earth and you is a growing concern for personal and planetary well-being. Understanding and managing electromagnetic pollution is crucial for a healthy environment. The impact of electromagnetic frequencies on human health is still being researched. Reducing exposure to harmful frequencies can improve overall well-being. Awareness of electromagnetic pollution can lead to a more sustainable future. Understanding hurts. The invisible force around us. HTTPS. Watch by YouTube.com. Pause. Watch. View the OSBL 7 OFF CVK. Four. Have you ever thought about the invisible forces around us? From the frequency impact on environment to how our bodies react to energy, Hertz is key. It's important to know about Hertz and how they shape our lives. Research on Earth vibrations shows our planet has a unique frequency. Human actions can change this. Hertz helps us measure electromagnetic waves. By studying Hertz, we learn how our actions impact the environment the natural frequency of the Earth and how it's affected by human activities. The role of Hertz in measuring electromagnetic waves and understanding their impact on the environment. The difference between natural and artificial sources of Hertz in our environment. What are Hertz and why they matter? Hertz measure the frequency of electromagnetic waves. By studying Hertz, we understand the world better. They help us see how our actions affect the environment. Hertz affecting Earth and you, a modern phenomenon. Our world is filled with artificial electromagnetic frequencies. These affect both the Earth and us. The Hertz affecting Earth and you is a big concern. Experts warn of risks from too much exposure to these frequencies. The energetic frequency influence on our planet is complex. It has far-reaching effects that we don't fully understand yet. Some key factors include Widespread use of wireless technologies such as cell phones and Wi-Fi routers. Increased deployment of 5G networks and other high-frequency technologies. Growing reliance on smart devices and the Internet of Things IoT. As technology advances, we must think about its impact. Understanding the Hertz affecting Earth and you and the energetic frequency influence helps. We can then work to lessen negative effects and find harmony between technology and nature. The Earth's electromagnetic field is not just a natural phenomenon, but also a vital component of our planet's ecosystem. As we continue to introduce artificial frequencies into the environment, we must be aware of the potential consequences and take steps to protect the delicate balance of our planet's energy. The Earth's Natural Frequency Schumann Resonance Studies on Earth's energy field studies have uncovered the Earth's natural frequency, known as the Schumann Resonance. This frequency is key to the Earth's electromagnetic environment. It affects the planet's vibration and, in turn, impacts life on Earth. The Schumann Resonance measures the Earth's vibration, crucial for Earth vibration research. The Earth's natural frequency deeply influences life, from plants to humans. It can change our mood, behavior, and well-being. For example, research shows it can alter our brainwave activity affecting our consciousness. Recently, changes in the Earth's natural frequency have caught scientists' attention. These changes might be due to human actions or natural events. 
As we delve deeper into understanding the Earth's natural frequency, we must consider its implications for our planet and its inhabitants. Key Findings in Earth Vibration Research The Earth's natural frequency is approximately 7.83 Hz. Changes in the Earth's natural frequency can affect our brainwave activity and state of consciousness. Human activities, such as the use of technology, can influence the Earth's vibration and natural frequency. By studying the Earth's natural frequency and its effects, we can better understand our planet and its inhabitants. This knowledge helps us develop ways to live in harmony with the Earth. Environmental Impact of Electromagnetic Frequencies Electromagnetic pollution is growing, raising worries about its long-term effects on nature, wildlife, and the climate. Frequency impact on environment is a focus of research. Studies show artificial electromagnetic frequencies might mess with natural processes and harm biodiversity. The idea of electromagnetic smog points to the buildup of electromagnetic radiation in our world. Wildlife, especially birds and bees, face risks from electromagnetic pollution. They use natural electromagnetic signals for navigation and talking. Artificial frequencies might mess with these, causing behavior changes and even population drops. The frequency impact on environment also affects plant growth and development. To grasp the environmental impact of electromagnetic frequencies, we need to look at a few things. Source and intensity of electromagnetic radiation. Duration and frequency of exposure. Distance from the source of radiation. By studying these, researchers can understand the risks of electromagnetic pollution better. They can then work on ways to lessen its harm. As technology use grows, tackling electromagnetic pollution is key to a healthier, greener world. How modern technology is changing our electromagnetic environment. Modern technology has greatly increased electromagnetic pollution. This can deeply affect our health and well-being. The rise of wireless tech like Wi-Fi and cell networks has changed our electromagnetic world. This has led to more exposure to electromagnetic frequencies, impacting our energetic frequency. The spread of smart devices in our homes and workplaces adds to the problem. These devices send out electromagnetic radiation, building up pollution levels. The impact of 5G network. The introduction of 5G networks will make the pollution worse. These networks use higher frequencies than before, increasing radiation exposure. It's crucial to understand the risks of 5G and how to protect our health. Reducing exposure to electromagnetic pollution. To cut down on electromagnetic pollution, we can take a few steps. These include Limiting our use of wireless devices. Choosing devices that emit less radiation. Creating a safe and healthy living space. By doing these things, we can lessen our exposure to pollution. This helps us live a healthier, more balanced life. Biological effects of frequency exposure. Exploring the impact of electromagnetic frequencies on our environment is crucial. Electromagnetic sensitivity awareness is growing, as some people may be more affected by these fields. Studies suggest that long-term exposure to certain frequencies can harm human health. This includes higher cancer risks, neurological damage, and reproductive problems. Bioenergetic resonance healing is a new field using specific frequencies for therapy. It aims to balance the body's energy fields, improving overall health. Practitioners believe these frequencies can help with symptoms like chronic pain, anxiety, and depression. Increased risk of cancer and neurological damage. Reproductive issues and birth defects. Disruption of the body's natural rhythms and cycles. Enhanced risk of chronic diseases, such as diabetes and heart disease. Research is ongoing, but it's clear that electromagnetic sensitivity awareness and bioenergetic resonance healing are key. 
By understanding the risks and benefits of electromagnetic frequencies, we can strive for a healthier environment. This is for ourselves and future generations. Measuring Electromagnetic Pollution in Your Space to understand the level of electromagnetic pollution, it's key to know the common sources. These include wireless routers, microwaves, and mobile devices. They all add to the pollution. Common sources of EMF in home. Here are some common sources of EMF in homes. Wireless routers and modem. microwaves and other kitchen appliances, mobile devices and tablets, televisions and computers, tools for detection and measurement. To measure electromagnetic pollution, you can use EMF meters, or you can hire a professional for an assessment. Also, geopathic stress solutions can help reduce the impact of electromagnetic fields on your health. By taking these steps, you can understand and reduce electromagnetic pollution. This promotes a healthier lifestyle. Protection Strategies Against Harmful Frequencies In today's world, we face many challenges from technology. It's important to think about how electromagnetic frequencies affect our health. Luckily, there are ways to shield ourselves and our surroundings from harmful energy. One method is using geopathic stress solutions to fight off negative earth energies. Another way is to practice bioenergetic resonance healing. This helps balance our energy fields through meditation, sound healing, or working with experts. To protect ourselves further, we can wear EMF blocking clothes and use home shielding techniques. This includes special paints or fabrics. By mixing these strategies with natural methods, we can make our environment healthier and more balanced. Utilize geopathic stress solutions to mitigate negative earth energy. Incorporate bioenergetic resonance healing practices to balance and harmonize energy fields. Implement home shielding techniques, such as EMF blocking paints or fabrics. The future of electromagnetic harmony. Looking ahead, we must think about how energetic frequency influence affects our world and lives. Studying Earth's energy field helps us understand how to live in harmony. By diving into Earth's energy field studies, we learn about our planet's natural balance and how to keep it. Biomimicry is key in creating balanced electromagnetic spaces. By copying nature's ways, we can make technologies that fit with the natural world. This method can lessen the bad effects of energetic frequency influence and help our ecosystem stay balanced. Future plans for electromagnetic harmony include new tech that can counteract bad frequencies. Earth's energy field studies will guide us in making green and safe buildings. Together, we can make our electromagnetic world healthier and more balanced for our planet's future. Important areas to focus on for electromagnetic harmony's future are Creating tech that lessens harmful frequency effects. Building more eco-friendly and safe structures. Keeping up with Earth's energy field studies to grasp our planet's natural balance. Global initiatives for electromagnetic safety. The world is waking up to the need for electromagnetic safety. This includes studying how electromagnetic frequencies affect the Earth's natural vibrations. It's a big step towards a safer future. International groups and governments are teaming up. They're setting rules for how much electromagnetic fields we can be exposed to. They also encourage the use of safer tech. International standards and regulations. Some countries have strict rules about electromagnetic exposure. Others are still figuring out their guidelines. For example, the European Union has set limits for electromagnetic fields. Some places even ban certain wireless tech in public areas. Research and development effort. 
there's a lot of research going on. Scientists are studying how electromagnetic fields affect us and the Earth. They're also working on new tech to reduce electromagnetic pollution. By focusing on electromagnetic safety, we can create a better world. We need to spread the word about the dangers of electromagnetic pollution. And we should support the use of safer technologies. Promoting electromagnetic sensitivity awareness through education and outreach programs. Supporting Earth vibration research to better understand the impact of electromagnetic frequencies on the Earth's natural vibration. Developing and implementing international standards and regulations for electromagnetic frequency exposure. Conclusion creating a balanced frequency future. As we wrap up our look at Hertz affecting Earth and you, it's clear that managing our electromagnetic sensitivity awareness is key. This is true for our health and the health of our planet. The mix of natural and artificial frequencies around us has big effects, impacting our environment and life itself. The modern world's electromagnetic challenges might seem tough, but there's hope. With more research, awareness, and responsible tech growth, we can live in a world where tech and nature work together. By using personal protection, shielding our homes, and backing global safety efforts, we can help our communities flourish in this frequency-driven world. We need a balanced way forward, using tech's benefits while keeping nature's rhythms alive. As we look to the future, let's work to create a world where the hurts affecting Earth and you helps us live in a healthier, more vibrant place. FAQ. What are hertz and why do they matter? Hertz measure the frequency of electromagnetic waves around us. These waves are everywhere in our environment. They affect our health and the planet in big ways. How do natural and artificial hertz differ in our environment? The Earth has a natural frequency called the Schumann resonance, which is good for life. But modern tech has brought a lot of artificial frequencies. These can mess up the natural balance. How is the Earth's natural frequency, the Schumann resonance, changing? Studies show the Earth's Schumann resonance is changing. This might be because of more electromagnetic pollution. These changes could affect plants, animals, and humans in big ways. What are the potential environmental impacts of electromagnetic frequencies? Electromagnetic frequencies can deeply affect our environment. More electromagnetic smog might harm ecosystems, wildlife, and even the climate. The long-term effects are still being studied. How are modern technologies changing our electromagnetic environment? Wireless tech like Wi-Fi and 5G has changed our electromagnetic world a lot. Smart devices at home and work also increase our exposure to these frequencies. What are the potential biological effects of frequency exposure? Research shows that certain frequencies can affect human health in different ways. Some people might be more sensitive to these fields. Bioenergetic resonance. Healing explores using specific frequencies for healing. How can I measure and assess the electromagnetic pollution in my personal space? You can use tools to find and measure EMFs at home and work. Knowing where EMFs come from helps you understand your exposure. Fixing issues like geopathic stress can also improve your environment. What strategies can I use to protect myself and my environment from harmful electromagnetic frequencies? You can use EMF blocking clothes and home shielding methods. These can reduce your exposure. Natural frequency balancing, based on bioenergetic resonance healing, can also help keep your space balanced.